Hello, this is Artifacts of Mars. And over the weekend, a group of elites, rhino Republicans, and most of the elites were from the private sector, were from Silicon Valley, I guess. Top tech giants from Apple, Google, Napster, Facebook, along with GOP elites, including Carl Rove, Mitch McConnell, Paul Ryan, Ben Sassy, don't know who he is. Kevin McCarthy, don't know who he is. Met at a secret island resort off the coast of Georgia to plot how to stop Trump. Uh, these are wacko rhinos and these uh, Silicon Valley billionaires and Huffington Post reported billionaires, tech CEOs, and top members of the Republican establishment flew to a private island resort off the coast of Georgia this weekend for the American Enterprise Institute's annual World Forum, according to sources familiar with the secretive gathering. Main topic at close to the press conflab, fab, how to stop Republican frontrunner Donald Trump. So, these liberal elitists were uh, trying. If you're a Trump supporter and you plan on voting in the primary, and you have. They're trying to take your vote away from you. So let's take a look at some of the, all the ones that the uh, liberal elitists and rhinos. Apple CEO Tim Cook. Google co-founder Larry Page, Napster creator and Facebook investor Sean Parker, Tesla Motors and SpaceX, Honcho, Elon Musk all attended. So did Majority Leader Mitch McConnell, Rhino from Kentucky, Political Guru and Rhino Carl Rove, House Speaker and Rhino, Paul Ryan. And here's a surprise. Tom Cotton of Arkansas. I thought he was conservative. I see I'm mistaken. I had high hopes for him, but... Unbelievable. Cory Gardner. Colorado, Tim Scott, South Carolina, Rob Portman, Ohio, and Ben Sassy, Nebraska, who recently made news that he cannot support Donald Trump. So this is, that's a list of the uh, rhinos that were there, and there are other rhinos there too. So these people are conspiring to take your vote away from you if you're uh if you voted for Trump in the primary and you plan to I am not in a political party, I support Trump. I think he is the one we need to start busting up the good old boys network and start doing some of the work of the American people instead of the work of these elitists. I mean, Republican and Democrat, what's the difference? Here's what Bill Crystal reported. The specter was humming the World Forum. forum. The specter of Donald Trump, Crystal wrote in an emailed report from the conference, borrowing the opening lines of the Communist Manifesto. There was much unhappiness about his emergence, a good deal of talk, some of it insightful and thoughtful about why he's doing so well, and many expressions of hope that he'll be defeated. Heading to AEI World Forum, lots of interesting guests. It's off the record, so please do not consider my tweets from there off the record. Please do consider them. Well, like I said, here we have a bunch of liberal, leftist, pinko, commie, elitists who are trying to steal your vote from you. Very disappointed, disappointed in Tom Cotton, who 
looked like he was a rising star and a rising conservative only to do this. Stab us right in the back. Very disappointed in him. You know, I might have expected something like this out of the, uh, liberal elitists from Silicon Valley. Well, even Paul Ryan and Mitch McConnell, but somebody like him and some of these other people, very disappointed in them. Oh, well, it's going to be a rough ride for Trump. Very rough ride. They're going to do everything they can to smear him and stop him. It's only going to make the supporters matter and matter. <laughs> I'm one of the supporters, and I'm getting matter and matter. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching.